Editor's note, this review may contain spoilers so who was that at the end of last issue? If you guessed a robot version of Cave's deceased wife, Masri you were right. So what's going on? In this alternate future, the Whisperer has already attacked and decimated the Earth. However, Cave and Doc Magnus have a plan. They are aware of a Muldrugian legend that says an heir of Sildana can defeat the Whisperer. They send a drone back through time and across dimensions to our cave which recorded events of his life and sort of led him to marrying Mazra. Our cave feels violated and manipulated as does Chloe as it appears their lives have been engineered. Magnus explains that they weren't trying to play matchmaker, just learn about Mazra and the jewel that is capable of imprisoning the Whisperer. The final part of the plan was the drone returning with the Whisperer to the future dimension and then uploading its data into the robot Mazra body. Oh, and that drone, that was Cave's eye dot with the Whisperer still a threat, they return to Muldrog and face a trio of creatures suffering from either phallic or mammarian enlargement. After the robotic Mazra saves the team, she then falls into a deep pit requiring Cave to request a parachute for a rescue mission. As always, this creative team is able to get more emotional response from the reader than one would think possible given the genre. Cave and Chloe's reactions to the robot Mazra are great, but what's even better is the robot Mazra's reaction when she sees them turn away from her. This Mazra has emotions based on Cave's memories and experiences with the real Mazra. This issue is proof that robots can cry. This is very subtly executed by Michael Avon Oming. Good work. Despite the deeply conflicting emotions our cave experiences between the sense of betrayal and desire to help save the world, this issue is still a lot of fun. No matter what happens, the events are never so dark or overwhelming that this book loses the fun aspect. This is a truly notable achievement. This series continues to straddle the world of science fiction fun and delicate human emotion without a misstep in either direction with either aspect. No negatives here, just more great comics. Even the monsters' misshapen bodies come off as humorous. Despite betrayal across time and dimension from one's future self. The fun that is always in this title is never diminished. Additionally, the events in this issue open up a whole new emotional angle for storytelling as the robot Mazra seems to be more than an automaton, but a real individual with thoughts, feelings and memories.